Good morning, good afternoon, it is Dave Trains. Guess what I'm gonna go do? Train. Dave Train. Dave Trains, what do we do before we go train? Pre-workout. Pre-workout. Before the video even starts, there is a discount on my training programs. So you can get 15% off of all the training programs on top of the already discounted price. So if you wanna get training programs, there's a first link in the description. Also, Overdrive is on pre-order, so if you wanna pre-order a tub, get it signed, lovely. There's a link in the description as well. Let's get into the video without further ado. But Let's take some pre-workout, let's go train, and then after we train, we're gonna go to the gym unit. We're gonna go there with my dad, dad trains. You're gonna meet dad trains, you're not actually gonna speak to him, but dad trains. We're gonna figure a few things out. We've already figured a, new, a few new things out, basically. We're gonna insulate the walls, and then instead of metal around the place, it's gonna be either wood or plasterboard, and then we're gonna paint it so it's like actual walls instead of just being fucking bare steel because it just looks ugly and it's really dirty and it's just not very good, okay? So, we're gonna do that, but first, Take pre workout, train. I am gonna try the blue raspberry flavor. See how that goes. It smells like bubble gum. When I tasted it with my finger before, it tasted like it smelled like bubble gum too. So it's very blue. Look how blue it is, Lou. Blue? Look how blue that is. I don't know if you can tell how blue this is. I literally, it's so, it's so much bluer than what it shows. It's like a very, very deep blue. It shows like a light blue here on my screen. But it's like a deeper blue, do you know what I'm saying? I had a little outfit change because material girl! I wasn't feeling very comfortable in the tight compression, so I'm feeling a bit loose today. I'm moving loose. Got loose? Got loose. Got loose. Alright, let's see what this is tasted like. The flavours are very subtle. Yeah, it's not as strong as you would expect. Maybe because I had just a ton of water. It tastes like I've had this before. You know bonbons, those sweets, like round sweets, or even like a blue ice lolly. You with me? Come try it. Um, Lucy hates blue raspberry shit. I've I've never tasted a nice blue raspberry pre-workout flavor. It doesn't taste like blue raspberry too much, like a really strong blue raspberry. Look what the smell was. The smell is gross. It's not that bad. <laughs> no, it's not. No, I think it's because I've always dry scooped blue raspberry. Because yeah, it's really strong. This isn't that strong, right? But I've diluted no, like this I much water, right? Okay, yeah, that's probably why. Whenever I've diluted ra blue raspberry, it's been with like a little bit of water like this, and literally the taste is like, it just, you know? This is bad drinkable. Fam. I prefer mango and pineapple and lemon. I agree. We never buy blue raspberry. If you want to make like a pre-workout lolly, I'll do you well, mate. I'm going to sit around, get ready, put my fucking clobber on, put my shoes on. I'll see you in a bit. Um, so it's just you and me now. I got this hoodie yesterday, and it's really nice. And I'm going to take mango and pineapple because I... Wasn't a huge fan of the blue raspberry, but I don't like blue, blue, blue raspberry, that's all. That is exactly what I thought. Okay, bye. Okay. He's up. Hi, guys. Hello. First things first, I'm not feeling too hot. Second thing second, we're gonna go train. You can get swollen anyways, right? Cameraman? Yeah, we're on that grind. All right, let's just get into the gym, because... I need to train and I need to go meet dad trains like ASAP pretty much because I don't know what time he's gonna finish work and what time he needs to be like meet me so I just need to go train, finish, get home, eat and then we're gonna go see dad trains. Papa trains. Dad trains. Adam trains. Papa trains. Adam trains. <laughs> yeah, alright. Let's go! I bought these on TikTok for a pound. No, one ninety nine. One ninety nine with delivery. It was like uh, TikTok, I'm pretty sure TikTok has got some like warehouse where they like beat kids into submission and uh, they make them make these, so two pounds, delivered. And they sound right, like they sound pretty much as good as my headphone. The Lenovo LP40, if you go on TikTok, type in Lenovo LP40, if it's your first time ordering off TikTok, you'll get, you get these for two pounds. I'm not like sponsored or any, literally anything, it's just, it's just free earphones. I'm gonna put these in the glove box, just for emergency reasons. If I ever forget my earphones, I know that these ones are gonna be like in my, um, in my car, so like, if you need a pair of earphones that can like throw away, if these like disappear in some, in some magical event, that's fine. But like, two pounds, bargain mate. They came and we tried them yesterday, so I got myself some as well. They're all good. I got white ones though, but I'm always like forgetting my earphones, so I thought. That's crazy guys, I wouldn't believe her, I wouldn't, that's crazy. All right, what's good? Welcome to the trading commentary. Basically, I am determined to fix my shoulder. I've had enough of my left shoulder, chest area giving me pain. So I decided I'm gonna bench press today and that went all right. I did 110, which is like quite light. I did set to five, I like RP, I don't know, five, like it wasn't heavy at all. Um, just some easy sets just to like ease them back into training. <clears throat> Basically my idea of, of what I'm gonna do is like, I'm gonna train the way I used to when my shoulders were at their healthiest. So 
I'm gonna do the free weight bench press, normal laying down bench press. I'm gonna do my best to like keep my shoulders back and down as hard as I can. Make sure I like take it slow, don't rush anything. And then, so I just did like five sets of five, I think, just to like, not any programming or anything, just literally banging some sets out just for the sake of it, just to like get moving again under the bar. Uh, instead of doing like smith machines or, or dumbbells or anything shit like that so again instead of doing dumbbell shoulder press which i think might be contributing to my pain i just started doing a uh, normal bar but barbell overhead press because it takes me through the full range of motion the scapular plane and everything else that's good for your shoulders so i know that the overhead press has never given me any shoulder issues and doing it today felt really good so i did that it was really good my shoulders are like my shoulder is feeling like better even after like one session which is like really really good right like this is exactly what i want i'm gonna get benching and i'm gonna fucking bench 200 kilos in, in a few days not really but you know what i mean I'm, it's gonna get better and it's it's gonna get better and i'm gonna be fucking doing way better i'm gonna be way happier because i can actually bench press and do what i want uh, then i did some lateral raises some triceps so over tricep extensions to hit the long head and then I finished off the training session with regular just tricep pushdowns. But basically, I've, I just want to stop being stubborn and actually fix my shoulder. So the bench press felt all right. Then the overhead press uh, feels good as well for my shoulders. And I'm sure that's going to help rehab a little bit. And I've also added face pulls to the end of every single one of my training sessions. I do like sets of 20. I do like five sets of 20 just to really like move my shoulder and my chest and everything through the right range of motion. Uh, so hopefully my shoulder and chest feels better and then I can bench press all the way in the world. So yeah, let's get back into the video because the training session is done. Love you loads in a bit. We are here like at the gym waiting for my dad to show up basically because um, he needs to like check out the place, look at the stuff, get more stuff measured up. But yeah, my dad said he's going to be here about 15 minutes ago. What slag. Dad trains is absolutely slacking. Okay, I can't be having that, mate. Lucy over here. It's God. freezing. She's absolutely freezing. Oh, is that him? That might be him. That's Dad Trains. Dad Trains. Papa Trains. What the fuck is up? I've got a delivery from my protein. Look at this. There's like 250 pounds worth of shit in here. Sick. Let's open it. I'm gonna need a knife. I've got a bread knife. Do you know why? Because I'm getting this bread. So much clothing in here. Tempo joggers. These are the joggers that I'm wearing uh, right now. Do you know why? Because they're sick. They're like the best joggers I have. So, tempo joggers. If you want to get some joggers, I'm going to disappoint you. These are the ones. Tempo joggers. High protein men's tempo short sleeve t shirt. It's the one I'm looking forward to. I've got a short sleeve and a long sleeve, but so it looks like it's got like white on the sleeves. So I'm going to put this on real quick. Ready? This t shirt is a bit tight, and I've just had a Nando's, so I'm not feeling all too nice about this top. Because look at this. Ready? I'm so full, my waist is probably about 55 inches at this point because I just had a fat, fat fucking Nando's. My protein women's essentials bra. All the way to Lucy. My protein men's tempo quarter zip up top. Tempo stuff is really good, like the tempo, I really like it. Just because, just because like the black, I always think it looks good. So there's like a long sleeve quarter, uh, quarter zip with white lines. I think this is gonna look all right. I'm not gonna put it on now, but this is gonna look nice. My protein men's tempo long sleeve. Clearway Isolate, Yuzu and Green Tea Flavor. Gonna give you the fastest taste test you've ever seen. It tastes like my pre-workout. I think that's, I like that a lot. I like that a lot. 10 out of 10. 10 out of 10. If you wanna get any of my protein stuff, by the way, not this, this is, I'm not allowed. Clothing, if you wanna get any of my protein clothing, this is for Lucy, not me, I don't like this stuff. If you wanna get some of my protein clothing, there's a discount code, Dave Trains. It's gonna be at least 35% off off of the whole order. And like, they run sales all the time, so 35% off, code Dave. My protein men's seamless essential top and I got a blue one as well because just like the long sleeves I got a uh, grey and a blue. Got some electrolyte tablets. We got Lucy clear away our isolate samples because she likes the way isolates because she doesn't have to get like chicken in her stomach so I gave her, I bought her some samples. If you microwave the brownies they taste really good. No they don't. Yes they do. Thai sweet chilli flavour. I've seen people gas these up. They're all sponsored though. So am I but I won't lie to you because who the fuck actually cares whether you're sponsored or not? Like, I'm not gonna fucking lie to you. 99 calories, 11 grams of protein, and this pack is literally, maybe has like five crisps. So if you want some more protein stuff, there's a discount code, Dave Trains, at least 35% off, and occasionally even more. 
but I'll let you know when that happens on the videos anyways. I should probably tell you what happened with my dad, sorry. I didn't record much because basically, I'm Polish, right? So is my dad. So I didn't record much because we're just talking in Polish, right? We came to the conclusion there's no point of like insulating the place whatsoever uh, because basically there's gonna be so much money and it's just gonna be a waste, essentially. We're gonna fill up all the gaps because there's loads of gaps like around the place. We're gonna fill up all that up so there's like no airflow going through so at least it's not like windy in there and if it's not windy then it's all right and then it's basically just gonna be a metal box i'm gonna put a massive massive like industrial heater in there so it will get warm in like five minutes it will also get cold in five minutes if i turn it off but for the duration of it being on everything's gonna be warm so that's how i'm gonna keep the place warm um building a platform for the deadlifts building a platform for the squat rack as well and uh just making sure like i fill up the walls with like mirrors and then like i'm gonna put some flags up or some bullshit like that i'll figure something out like davetrains.com behind me um yeah you'll see anyways but basically that's the update we're not insulating the place we're just gonna clean it all up make it all nice build the platforms everything and then crack on i'll see you when i see you hey it's the next day i need to go to a building supply shop type place to grab like boards glues fucking whatever's we're gonna go there, we're gonna grab some stuff, I'll record some stuff on my phone because if you can see the size of this camera, it's literally like the size of my torso, I can't be carrying that around, I look fucking stupid in the shop, so I'll just record a few bits, talk to you about that, and yeah, let's go! That is pretty much that for the days. So I've got rest day today, so I've got literally nothing to do. I'm gonna edit this video up. I'm gonna sit around, do some work, do some other work, figure some stuff out. I need to figure some more stuff out from the gym, but that trip bought like wood, fixing, screws, random stuff like that. That was 630 pounds, I think. And I bought some mirrors yesterday, which were another 300 something pounds, so like a thousand pounds down the drain. Not really, not really down the drain, because all of the stuff that I am putting in there, like you might think, oh, it's a rental, why are you investing, whatever. You can disassemble everything and I can take it with me. So like all the boards are just for like the mirrors to be fixed up and then for the platforms and stuff like that, which can all be taken apart and taken with me. So if I ever move to a different place, those can be taken, readjusted and like placed in a new gym. So yeah, if you enjoyed the video, please consider subscribing, like the video. There are links down in the description if you want to support me, buy some programs, pre-order overdrive, uh, my protein, anything like that. This rest day fleece makes me look sick. So I like this, I like this hoodie. Anyways, I'll see you in the next video. Thank you for watching. Bye bye.